Hello everybody and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey where I finally figured out that this is probably the Minotaur quest that my dad was talking about and not the other one because I remember at one point being a little bit confused like this is the person I'm supposed to talk to about an ancient artifact my biological dad the big I don't know what was his name math guy I don't care math man um he was like you gotta go talk to people about the Minotaur. And then I did the whole Minotaur thing. And at one point I was like, is this, this doesn't feel quite right. And then it like never really like resolved itself. And I was like, oh, well maybe something will pop up like when I actually go see, search it out. Cause I was focusing on the, um, on the cultists instead. So I grabbed this uh, viewpoint also, which I'm pretty sure I can just fast travel right back to the, but I wanted to do this anyway. Anyway, I have to go investigate and talk to the people. Oh, I should probably just fast travel. The entrance. Okay, I mean, I guess I'll just go through with the whole thing. Thought it was for the dead. E nope. Uh. Okay, here we go. But yeah. I remember being like, oh well, like I guess I'll, maybe something will pop up when I'm actually searching for the artifacts to Atlantis, but apparently this is me, sort of doing a cultist thing and doing an artifact of um, Atlantis as well. To be, okay, to be honest, the last episode was going to be the last one I recorded tonight because I was like, I gotta get stuff done, but forgetting I'm right at the gate to the Minotaur, and... I'm like, nah, like, and I want to see, like, a Minotaur's and Men sound, it legitimately sounds like a cool quest. I'm just mad that, like, I don't know, it wasn't, I mean, and maybe, maybe I'm just not paying attention. Maybe I'm actually rushing it and kind of playing it in a way that I shouldn't be, because I'm trying. But, like, I feel, I don't know, it's like, you're gonna have people who finish the game, and all they want to do then is, like, they finish the game without killing all the cultists. So they just want to go and kill all the cultists and get that ending, you know? So, like... That's kind of where I'm at, is I'm like, okay, I want to get the cultist ending, like, I just want to kill cultists, and then, like, they're like, no, we want you to do all these other quests, and I'm like, do you know how many hours this I've put into this game? should know something about swordfish. Hello. Uh, oh, I am so sorry. Monger? I'm looking for swordfish. Shh. Are you crazy? I heard somebody whispering. You don't find swordfish. Uh, you? Okay. You look like a shifty sort. I hear you're looking for a certain fish. You yes. have a nice voice. Swordfish. I hope you know what you're in for. He's ruthless. Cut off a man's nose just for sneezing. I feel like this, there's some sort of nose joke going on here. It's like, oh, he's got a swordfish must have a long nose. And it's like, no, nah, he doesn't. He's just good at the sword. And he works with fish. And then there's like this whole like sneezing Cut, get your nose cut off for sneezing. Where anyway. is he? No one's seen him in a long time. Why are you telling me? But there's a rumor he controls Heraklion from a hideout underground. Why are you telling me, old man? <laughs> That's ridiculous. It's no. all I know, mistress. It's not ridiculous. Why is that ridiculous? If he's so dangerous, why are you talking it to sounds me? perfectly reasonable. I'm old, tired, sick of bowing down to pay fees. If you can take him out... We're all better for Your it. teeth are Not remarkable. Not another word out of you, Malaka. I have orders. Everyone who talks about swordfish must die. Okay. Why didn't that work? Um... Don't cause any trouble here. Well... Am I not supposed to... Beat you guys up? Oak. Mm. Yeah, um. I'm still paying fees okay. to swordfish. Okay. Hurry up and find his underwater hideout. Okay. okay. Um. I feel like I was supposed to. Mm -hmm. Nope, that's not the one I wanted to do.
I'm kind of confused. I'm a little confused. Are these just regular? Okay, they're just like regular civilians? Okay. They were all grouped up like thugs. I'm confused. I'm gonna go. Bye. Stay on this boat. Off I go. I'm confused. Oh wait, actually. Ah uh, no. <laughs> okay. I actually was thinking about switching my armor over. Like upgrading. What's the what Amazonian? Oh, they're like war. I mean, they look like straight up warrior damage, you know. Oh, and I already have this one already engraved and stuff. No, okay, I'm just gonna, okay, I'm just gonna take this, take it, and then I go. Ooh. Finally, and I can kill those sharks again, because they've respawned. So I will help the pretty lady. Please don't crash boat, because I, I can't fight the shark underwater. Yay! Oh good, I was gonna I was gonna look at it, but I can see she's got the completed mark on her head. Alright, pretty lady, uh we're gonna do your your quest for you. I I mean I already looted what was here, but you're more than welcome to look for anything else that's left. You're back. Have you killed them? Yeah. I took care of them. Every last one. Job well done, mercenary. Here, yeah, this is yours. sharks all over the place. You should join my crew. You're strong, capable, and obviously resourceful. I could use someone like you on my crew. What do you say? If you think there's room for two mercenaries on board, I'll join you. <laughs> yeah, man. Mm, yeah. <laughs> oh, buddy. I really wanted a romance. Not gonna lie. I was really hoping that I could. But it was a timed quest, so I figured I couldn't, but, you know, still. No harm in trying, and now I can at least have her around, but, it, you know, she'll have to be below decks, I guess, because my parents, my family, <laughs> my parents are around, I gotta, you know, I gotta be good, I guess. Anyway, I've been here, this is the third time. Third time's a charm, having to swim through freaking limbs. By the gods, what's going on yeah, here? Yeah, but swordfish. Pretty disgusting. Let's be real. What? Oh, okay. All right. This is not a me get to sneak up thing. This is a chat chit chat time. Demos, I De knew you'd come. Demos. Dog! Dog of Cosmos! Have you come to I bite? mean, I'm wearing his armor, but, uh... Let's try lying. I've come to tear your face off, Swordfish. You think I haven't been preparing for this day? I'm here for the... I won't go back! I won't go back in there! I don't care if I owe the cult. I want out! You want that artifact? Go fetch it! What? Once a cultist, always a cultist. What do you want from me then, Vimos? Answers. And you will give them to me. What? What happened in there that drove you to this? The Minotaur happened! I was lucky! Nikios, though. The Cosmos promised me everything! Not this! What? I mean, he's obviously, okay, my first reaction hearing him say um, that he wants out, I was like, oh no, he's been trapped into doing this, and blah, 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 but he's also the guy who's like chopping up people limb from limb. I'm pretty sure it's him. You know, like, I don't think it's somebody else doing this, and he's like, the sharks need more, I need more, blah, 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 I'm like, ah. so at first I was like, I gotta help him, but now I'm like, you're a scumbag. How did you end up so I gotta remember he's a scumbag. I'm hiding amongst the filth. And from it, I can't show my face anymore. But the Rachlion is still mine. All its fish. What? And all its people. Okay, you're crazy. You're yeah, he's crazy. How 
did you get into the labyrinth? Nikios had a key. He put it into the steel. Yep. Pretty standard. But you can't go in there. He'll kill you. He'll get out and kill us all. So you left Nikios you in there? It. That's what Nikios so said. Keep it distracted. Did he I'll go in um, from the the the, the thing? <laughs> like from the Minotaur encounter, or has he always been insane? Like him don't get knocked over. I was hoping for a knockover effect and that did not happen. Not so good with a sword after all. I mean you're okay, but I'm OP. A little bit. No, not a lot. A little bit. You can find Drachmi anywhere if you look hard enough. All it takes is a little persuasion. Drink wine from the same cup. The hollowed out skull is his first sacrifice to Cosmos, the skull of his father. Time wore on. Time wore on the man, as time wears on us all after a life of malice, he sought to free himself from the cult. He refused to meet them in Delphi, and never bowed to the one known as Deimos. Old habits, however dark, would prove hard to break. O okay. Servants of the mighty Cosmos, we once cried out for heroes of chaos. I answered the cry, how quickly you've all forgotten. And now this is what it's come to. One came from my head on his way to Melos. Don't get it. Don't didn't get it, praise Cosmos. Send this new mystery warrior Demos to Masara if you must. I won't be stopped. Cosmos will protect me. When all fall, we stand. Okay, so okay, so okay, this makes sense. Heroes of the cult, then. Um These were people that tried to do like great things, and this is the last one. Somebody who tried to do something even greater than the others, which was take on the Minotaur. And they're studying the ruins. Maybe that these guys don't really know what what's all what what the ruins are all about and stuff, but they had to do great deeds to unlock these artifacts. Who are you? Are you Nikolaus or the collector? Oh no, the past, the, present, and future. Sage name is near to the cultists of cosmos. I guess the collector would probably be like more of an intellectual, probably, since they have like a nice house and all this stuff. Makes more sense for the hero's person to be a little bit beefier. Fought under no one's banner, so was able to go where no soldier or hero could. This afforded the cult great flexibility. Where there was struggle against their will, Exeus would appear as if by coincidence. He drank and celebrated and sang songs with those who composed Cosmos' will. And then when the celebration settled, those people were never seen again. Hmm. Okay. Right, that was freaking a long time ago. The legend forgets his greatest heroes. He has forgotten me, but soon you will remember. My bandits have overrun the Sarah. Soon the world will be ours. We will build a new temple for Cosmos, a pure temple. And if the stage opposes me, there will be sacrifices on my altar. Uh, secret journal. Swordfish is a secret journal. So apparently the legend is younger than um, Swordfish. But he, it did say that time caught up to him as well. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Interesting. Okie dokie, Smokey. Interesting, interesting. He wanted out. Manor. Yeah. Haunted by the Minotaur to the ferry. I leveled up again. And I get to keep looting. Every time I come in here, there's something more. 2% damage dealt, restored his health. Holy moly, that can, that can actually add up. Blood in the water. All right, this is cool stuff. I think I was saying earlier, yeah, I was going to be done tonight, and then I got too intrigued by all of this, like, Minos' temple, like, or, sorry, uh, Minos' palace, and, like, Minotaur, like, this is, an, this is another monster, so I fought the Sphinx, 
and I spot the Cyclops, and we're gonna fight a real Minotaur, not a fake Minotaur, which I got distracted by the fake Minotaur. Okay, I'm really sorry about that. My recording, I think my computer is just kind of done for the night, honestly. It's like freaking out. Um, but I, I was in the middle of just saying, you know, yeah, I got tricked by that, um, that old min that Minotaur quest, the earlier. But like, not really. I guess I kind of knew. I was like, this isn't quite what it needs to be, and I'll finish it up later. Anyway, I feel like I've said that like three times. Um, but it's been a long day and a long night. However, okay, so I just killed that guy, right? Um, well, when I did, it said I had a new breastplate, so I looked at it, and apparently my, I, like, erased a few of the old ones, but, like, it upgraded my Amazonian one, which was, like, a level 29? I didn't do that. It did it itself. I don't know why, because I, the brand new thing that I got from this guy was the Amazon Bracers. Those were, those were also brand new when I went in and looked, so I'm a little confused. I don't even think, yeah, I, I have I have the bracers and the helmet and the breastplate, but I don't have the um, the greaves or the skirt on me. I mean, I could go to the ship, but yeah. Anyway, why is it? Why is she like totally? It's not even her. Like it does. This guy looks like himself. But I've, I've noticed with several of these, they don't, like, uh, some of them, like, don't look like who they are at all. It's a little weird. Like, honestly, I'm a little weirded out by it. I think I got this guy on accident. Like, especially because that woman was black, and they gave her a white woman's portrait. Like, what the heck? That's really weird. Anyway... I'm gonna fast travel to my ship really quick, actually, and pick up the Amazonian outfit. And I might start wearing that and just engrave. Oh, no, no, no. I can do the thing where I change the appearance. That's right. I need to do that. I will change the appearance of my current outfit to the Amazonian one. But I won't change the perks because I prefer the perks on this one. It's funny, I think I think that guy mistakes you for Deimos no matter what, but it was funny that I was wearing Deimos' armor. Alright, I'm not actually sure quite how to go about... Um, I have, I just need... I don't know if I need to be holding on to them or not when I do this. That's right, I leveled up. Woohoo! Anyway. Oh, okay, there's the... Uh, wait, nope, what am I trying to do? What is that doing? Oh, I see. Oh, I'm toggling the headgear. Okay. I was like, what am I doing? <laughs> Here's how I do it. Well, uh, uh, eh, eh. What? Oh, yeah. Oh, hello? Um... Change the appearance. Oh man, I'm freaking never gonna find them. I wish they would like they would goldify these ones. Like, oh yeah, these are the ones. Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh, we're gonna look so stinking good. Okay, okay. Amazon tacits. I don't know. That's what they were called, but. Span of the immortal. Belt of Ares. Oh. Break, I don't know. I 
I mean, what I got on looks pretty good. There it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. We look like fucking Robin. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, my gosh. I love it. I love it so much. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. We are Wonder Woman. This lighting is so good, too. This lighting is so good. Oh my god, hang on. Preview with like the greens and everything. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so excited! Ah! Okay, it's, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, it's a little it's a little weird just because like I'm not used to seeing her like with like bare shoulders. Uh, both of them. Usually she only has like one, depending on the armor set, she'll only have like one uh, bear. But yeah, anyway, I'm distracted. I killed the cultist. Yay me. And I, okay, yeah, I unlocked, I unlocked that guy who's also level 50. I mean, I could go take care of this one. Give me details. Where are you at? I will take care of the myths and minotaurs thing, but that is obviously something that I can do when I'm actually doing when I'm actually hunting down the artifacts. But I'm kind of like, uh, I kind of want to do it, but I, <laughs> I I might I might actually, apparently, you, I think I read that really quick that you can get a lot of XP from it, so I'm gonna go take this guy out for sure. And we'll hopefully, I, I just need to level up so I can get to level 50 and be able to take out these like level 50 people. Like, cause, cause they're driving me. <laughs> I mean, crazy. They're like, so... Oh my gosh, we look so cool! Cassandra looks so good in this outfit! Part of me is like, maybe I shouldn't wear the Amazonian outfit before I go to, like, meet the Amazons, because they're gonna be like, you stole our armor! I mean, like, that's what, that's what they, that's what the Amazonians would do. Like, if you showed up in their armor. I mean, maybe as a woman, they'd be like, oh, maybe you inherited it from my mother or something that, like, you know, came down, but, like... It like left at some point. It was like it was here or something. I don't know. Maybe they would give me the benefit of the doubt, but I think they had also murderized me pretty quick if they thought I had stolen it from somebody. Barnabas, what's that large landmass up ahead? It's Crete, land of mystery. Oh my gosh, we've heroes. already talked about that. The Seos and the Minotaur. You know the story? Parts of it. The Seos was an Athenian hero. It wasn't a very popular tale in Sparta. Ah, oh, it's I an look epic so story. Good. Into the oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I have to, I have to like freak out about this. Oh my gosh. Take the photo. We look so cool. It's like Wonder Woman taking on the world. One boat at a time, one ship at a time, whatever. Oh my gosh, I'm just mega so excited for it. An unsurmountable task. Get the triumph and save the people of Nemo. Uh-huh. I feel like the sales and I should have come back. Cheer up, Cassandra! The gods are on your mm -hmm. side! When your task is accomplished, we'll go somehow. Drink one! Enemies are close! Get ready! I need us! We did it hit!
Oh my gosh, please. Archer to the front! Speed up! any tablets to upgrade my ship I checked earlier yeah you need tablets from ancient ruins which is sort of frustrating because I'm like what the frick like I already need money and I need like iron and wood and I get that but why do I need ancient tablets why because they want you to explore all the ruins too like I don't know there's just little things in this game that kind of piss me off the quests are cool but like they like some of them like, like I feel like over half of them are pretty cool but like just the way they, I feel like I'm forced to do them sometimes with also, also without being like, at least for me, like, I don't know, maybe it's just the point in the game I'm at where I'm like trying to just do a certain thing and I, I'm being like, it's taking me hours to do it, to do like one tiny part of this thing that I want to finish and I'm like, you know, go you know what I mean? It's just, it's just one of those things. Just let me murder people, okay? Why is this, uh, why is this difficult? I guess this isn't really gonna help me, but, um... I guess I'll... Yeah, because this is not very powerful right now. Like, it's okay, but... That's not great. I also do remember which button combos were, like, lighting my arrows on fire and which ones weren't. He's got so many ships with him. Why can't I have ship friends? Why can't I have like, I have a summon a lieutenant button. And I'm like, or hear me out. I have a, I can summon an entire fleet button. That would be nice. Well, I just spent the last 30 minutes, 20 minutes of looking for one battle. And I got him down to half health, but I couldn't do it. <laughs> I am just not, I was, I was trying real hard, like I was using the waves to my advantage and stuff, but I literally can't, I can't, I can't upgrade anything because I don't have, um, tablets, and I can't, I just checked the blacksmith, and you can buy everything except tablets, so that's cool, I guess, I don't really know at this point even how long I was, uh, doing this, but I guess for now I'll do some of the collector, or for some of the like myth and minotaur ones. Which sounds way more fun at this point, honestly. I think. Yeah, that was a pain. I didn't, like, I, I tried a couple different methods, one, you know, just to ram the star and then, like, run away, and I actually got it to the point where I, I isolated his ship, so I didn't have to deal with, like, the four other ships, and we were just kind of circling each other, and I was doing pretty well, but, like, it just takes so long to chunk, literally 20 minutes just to get him down to half health, and I was just using arrows, like, staying at maximum range, using the swells and the rise in the, in the water, you know, and... I was trying to get him to antagonize one of the Athenian ships that was out there, but he wouldn't hit them. <laughs> Even when I was on the other side, I was like, no, come on. So, you know. I don't know. I, that's one of the reasons I haven't done the pirate one, honestly. Like, the pirate outfit. Legendary armor set. is because it requires going out on the ship. And while I freaking... I thought when I started this game that I'd be all over that, that I'd be like never on, um, like very rarely on land, but it's just like, in this game it feels like they just kind of threw it in there to be like, oh yeah, you know how everybody liked, you know, sailing a pirate ship in Assassin's Creed 4? Uh, yeah, we're gonna do, just put that, put that mechanic in again, but we're gonna make it harder and not the focus of the game. So, like, I don't know, like, you, it's, it, when it's not the focus of the game, it becomes something tedious and extra in a way like it's not necessary at all and it's not it doesn't show as much of an upgrade as quickly as it did in four 
You must be the hoarder. The collector. Dust collector, maybe. Yeah. I'm here about the Minotaur. The... No, no, no. I don't. I can't. I don't know anything about the Minotaur. Ardos sent me. He says you know things. Ardos? The boy. Never talk to the boy. We all promised. Hmm. I'm not here to break bones. I'm here for information. Give it to me, and I'll be on my way. I'll answer your questions, but you won't ask the right one. I've already Can we killed not play games? two of them. Fine. You're going to need Theseus' armor, which I sold to be part of a collection at the fort. There's nothing wrong with my armor. Yeah, what? Nikios thought his armor was the finest in the Greek world. He could have worn Theseus' when we found it. But I was the perfect fit. Minotaur struck me right in the chest. Should have died. But Nikios... Don't make Nikios' mistake. Wear Theseus' armor. Hmm. What do you know of the boy? Son of Nikios. Stubborn. A little shit. His father's son. You remember him fondly enough, yet you refuse to speak to him. If I speak, he might not listen. The truth is armor against little, Mystios. You said you sold Theseus' armor. Who has it? A military commander, stationed in the fort. He has a cave filled with Excellent. all sorts of prizes. I can speak in the caves. The armor is his crown jewel. Sounds like a hard thing to part with. No, easy. That armor, it would have saved Nikios. It would have saved the boy's father. Yet, I wore it. I didn't deserve. Ah. The armor haunted me. No point keeping ghosts in my collection. Yeah, this guy's really, like, skinny. Breathe, Collector. I've learned enough. If the Zeus's armor is still in the fort, I'll find it. There are more pieces of the Zeus's armor. I've only managed to attain another two legendary of them. armor set. But someone stole one from me. If you find it, you can have it. But give whoever took it a piece of my mind, and perhaps a piece of your blade. You're pretty bloodthirsty for a collector. What do you have? Uh, some stuff. Some stuff. Well, okay. Yep. I can't. Looks like I can't actually go in your house and look around at cool stuff. I wonder if I could... Probably not. I was like, I wonder if I could uh, talk to him and like buy it, but probably not. Residing in Minos' legacy. His collection is stored in Dea de Lassis Fort. Is it over here? Nope. Southwest of Gorton City. Are we in Gorton? I think we are. West. Hmm. Is this the fort? It might be the fort where the leader is. I mean, I killed the other leader. <laughs> but the new leader. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, hmm. I kind of lost track of time. I'm not really sure what's... I guess I can run over here and attempt to at least steal it. I'm just worried about my recording. It's gone on for quite a while because I spent so long trying to the hidden cave. destroy that ship. I mean, if I could sneak in, that would be ideal. Like, no assassinating the entire fort. I don't have to lower the freaking fortification level of this area. But if I can find a sneaky way in... somebody like an Athenian for democracy named the Dreadful. It's not an ideal name. I feel like... I mean, I'm hoping... I'm hoping there's a secret entrance. This is something else. Oh, okay, well, over there, sort of, maybe, it might just be try to stay out of sight. an e entryway, like a normal one that everybody uses. Yeah, I might be better off stopping here. Okay, I am. I got really lucky. 
lucky. Honestly, I just got real lucky. Whoop. Oh, God. I can't use my bird in here. Okay, hang on. It's just blue. Okay, if I can like get out of here real fast and then just like fast travel away, it'd be freaking ideal. <laughs> nope, can't fast travel. Oh god. Oh no 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 no. Okay, that was like <sighs> the easiest sneak in and out of a place I've ever done. I'm just so lucky there was nobody on guard outside the friggin' place. That was that was real big lucky. Like, let's be real. Um Okay. Can I not? Okay. Alright, I do think I'm out of time for this one though. If nothing else, maybe not in the episode, but in real life. So I don't know. These ones got weird, but I've spent like five hours playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey today, and in the end. I'm excited to play more because this is really cool and I'm gonna fight an actual Minotaur in King Miles' friggin' palace and that's really cool. Um, and... I don't know, if anybody wants to drop me hints or links on ruins that have a lot of tablets in them that I can yoink, or an easy way to farm tablets, that'd be great. Because I have enough resources, I think, to upgrade my ship pretty well, but at this point, this person's like two levels lower than me, and I still can't take them out with my ship. So... Ah, <laughs> I just want to kill some cultists! Anyway, thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it, and I hope to see you in the next one.